Hi and welcome to episode 5 of the Earl and Grath hard mode. Today we'll be uh, doing some work for others and we will at the same time uh, deliver our bales, uh, look at the chickens and some other things. It's a snowy day, just uh, like February is supposed to be, I guess. And uh, we are uh, heading over to the chickens to see how they are doing. And if uh, there has been any development over the night. And yeah, still 301 chickens. So. Uh, I guess uh, there's not much to do today. Uh, the bales are still not fermented. We are uh, looking at uh, just around 90. Oh, that one needs to be sold. Uh, we're not going to use the front loader big bag lifter anymore. So just get rid of it. <coughs> Sorry, I'm a little bit sore in my throat at the moment. And uh, well, we can we can deliver the eggs. That's what we can do. There are some eggs over there. Uh, we are still not at a at a rate where we can make a lot of money every day for the eggs, but uh, hopefully we'll get there. I am uh, thinking maybe to have one more chicken pen just to uh, to move over the young uh, chicks and uh, make money on selling them at some point uh, but I uh, I've been thinking about it and uh, at the moment I will just uh, keep keep it like it is until I have all the heads uh, old enough sort of for uh, for eggs etc okay so let's get that pallet on it's a little bit tricky uh, seems like there's a small elevation uh, in the concrete there so maybe you have to go and uh, flatten it a little bit let's see what we can get done uh, preferably I would like to have a telehandler as well they are easier to operate but anyway this is what we have at the moment and uh, it's what we have to live with okay there we go and then we can put the straps on Now it's only to uh, take off the weight on the back before we connect the, the small trailer. Uh, would be nice if we could maybe have a small tractor for for this job, driving back and forth with the eggs at some point. Maybe a quad bike or something if it if it's available. I don't know. Um, the only thing I know is that if I need to uh, to uh, at some point get a mod to get it in, I, I will not be using it. And there we go, money is ticking in. It's not much uh, for the time being, but uh, it's money. So, almost 1900 for a yeah, one and a half pallet. So it's not that bad. Uh, 
I uh, I guess when when uh, when whenever the the chicken pen is full, we have 360 chickens. Uh, all of them lay egg. We should probably have like two pellets a day, maybe. I don't know. Let's see. Okay, so uh, I'll uh, connect the the loader and we'll uh, see. There we have it. Uh, the bales are ready and I will start delivering. And uh, I've added some music to uh, to this high speed uh, video now, so uh, hopefully you enjoy it. last batch of bales uh, had to cut it down quite a lot the, that sequence it was just too much anyhow uh, there won't be that much bales to deliver uh, in the future as I'm I've come to the conclusion that we need to have uh, some normal uh, Product uh, in in maybe one, may one or two fields uh, nearby the farm. 
So uh, as soon as uh, the grass has been mowed for one more load of bales, I will uh, start plowing up uh, the area. Um, yeah, as I mentioned late, uh, earlier, uh, a small tractor just to have, uh, have for uh, egg driving would be nice, but uh, I don't know, it seems like it's quite expensive and we, we need to, to save, uh, save our money. Um, we should actually be able to buy a field soon as well. Uh, but that will wait until the spring because I think the price on the fields doesn't actually increase much um, when uh, or after it's been uh, sowed. So. Uh, I will uh, I will wait for that to happen and then see what happens. Um, yeah, it's a uh, Landini or the Riggy track or uh, yeah, the Sator as well. But uh, I've never liked the Sators, uh, so uh, that's that's what we have to work with if we want to buy. A small tractor. Uh, I haven't managed to find any quad bikes or anything like that uh, either. So, well, you have the John Deere and the Mahindra, but it's it's not a quad bike uh, <coughs> by my definition, at least. So, um, yeah, and we we can't go all crazy with a. Uh, full truck and uh, all that at the moment uh, we're definitely not big enough for that so well nothing here for the for the offers and the used vehicle so that class is extremely cheap uh, and it's what uh, <coughs> Yeah, you can uh, have it at 295, so yeah, it's almost a hundred, hundred horsepowers uh, more than the one we have. Uh, the question is if we need it and if, if we get enough money for the Massey. Uh, I, I don't think it's a wise to spend more money on the tractor now we we can manage with the, the one we have I think um, and there's no front loader on it either it seems so that alone should be good enough reason to drop it I guess <coughs> eighty two thousand almost for the Massey and probably a little bit more if we repair it and drive it to the shop let's see here it's not a large tractor it's a medium tractor actually um, there we are yeah so fair amount off on that one actually but uh Should we do it or not? I, I don't think so. Um, anyway, time has run off. It's uh, evening. And uh, I guess it's uh, time to go to bed soon. Um, let's just have a <coughs> quick look at the chicken pen there are still some food left and we have more eggs as well so a quarter of a pallet is it mm, yeah anyhow that will be added to delivery uh, some other day we'll save up a little bit here 
I uh, haven't seen any uh, any issue with the with keeping the eggs for some time. So uh, we'll deliver it in uh, in a big bulk. Anyway, time to go and get some sleep. And uh, here we are next day, bright and shine. Uh, the grass is still not ready. I was hoping it would be uh, ready now. Uh, so uh, for today's work, it's uh, basically getting some contracts done, maybe. Uh, see if we can make some additional money on that. Um, not much more. Uh, <coughs> There's still like uh, only half. Uh, uh, it's it's not much food left. Maybe we should uh, do something there. Um, nothing on sale at the moment, which is cheap enough for us. That. <coughs> That sewing machine is kind of interesting, but uh, I think we need the money to other things. Uh, okay, only one contract here, so uh, I think we we need to uh, maybe take that one. So we. Uh, it's the field just next to the shop as well, so it's, uh, it's not that far a travel. But uh, yeah, uh, I'm I'm probably going to do uh, some contracts uh, after this episode and uh, prepare the farm so there will be uh, more variation to the to the jobs that needs to be done. Uh, or else this series will be dead boring, I guess. Uh, it probably is already, but uh, uh, I'll uh, see what I can do to, to get a more active uh, operation on the farm. Um, and if you have any tips, just let me know and I'll, uh, I'll evaluate and uh, probably implement as well. So. Um, Let's see. Um, so English machine is set to corn. Um, I don't think it was corn. Was supposed, I did not check actually what, uh, what type uh, we should sow. But uh, let's see. Um, unfolding the. So we're and it's a sugar beet. Okay, and just change the sugar beet, and uh, there we go. I'll uh, let you have some music on that one as well.
Okay, so that's it. The worker did the most of it, uh, but still, we're making money. So, uh, this is it for uh, today. Just to deliver the sower back uh, and uh, also remove the, the seeds we have in it. Uh, and uh, 